here. That is still actually a pretty decent build and one that you can build in the workshop. That is one that still holds up the test of time. Hey there, it's Big Tony over here at Nat G coming at you with some Beacon Rush action here in War Robots. We are on Dead City. And I'm going to start with my Dagon here. My Dagon is equipped with uh, Tamers and then four MK2 level 12 Splinters. This is a damage inflicting little monster. And definitely one of my, it's, it's, it's turning into one of my favorite bots to run. Outside of the Fenrir, I mean, there's just so many bots right now that I just love running it, and this is turning into one of them. Okay, let's uh, go ahead and cap. We got that beacon cap. Let's go ahead and just, let's just use this teleport and get back over here. Now, let's go ahead and talk a little bit about a topic. Okay, let's talk about the ultimate weapons and ultimate bots. And do I think they're even worth going for in the game? And... For you guys who've been watching the channel or have been or subscribed and get notifications, yesterday I dropped a uh, oh, there's a nice assist right there. Uh, I dropped a short showing my uh, ultimate. I, I did go ahead and open a couple of the ultimate crates, lucky draws, and you guys. I, I posted the one that I got something rather interesting in. For you guys who haven't went and saw it, I'm not going to ruin it for you. Go look at that short, and I'll, you'll find out exactly what I got. But I did, uh, you know, it spurred me on to think about, is the ultimate builds really worth putting your time in? And in that short, I give an opinion there as well. I'm going to kind of back that up right here, which is, as a free-to-play or pocket chain spender, I don't think the ultimate builds are worth it. I, I really don't. There's so much over-the-top stuff coming out, and there's so much that demands your resources already as a free-to-play or pocket chain spender that it's just really, really not worth your time to go find an old bot that just has a little extra oomph to it. I don't think it's worth it. I really, really don't. And the amount of resources you spend to level that stuff up is crazy insane. So uh, definitely go check that shirt out and you'll see exactly what I got. And then, of course, today posted uh, about the same. Uh, it should have been, it'll be posted uh, probably after, it'll be after midnight. It'll be a few hours before this video comes out. Uh, it'll also be, I'll post my first footage of that particular item on the battlefield. And <laughs> you'll see exactly what I think when you see the title of it. Uh, yeah, well, we just won't go any farther into that. I'm just saying I would steer away from that, guys. Don't waste your, uh, upgrade tokens are precious commodities. You don't need to waste it on things like that. Okay, let's go ahead and get this guy out of here. Come on, you big old Fenny. That's a weird Fenny build, too. A Reaper slash Sonic Havoc build. Holy mackerel! That's not that's not a that's not a, a very good balanced build right there. I, I definitely would run something a little different. The damage mitigation was good on the Reapers until they. Uh, well, there's nice Beyond God like was actually pretty good until they really nerfed down the reload time on them. So now it really is not a good weapon to put on a Fenrir. But I'm guessing that guy. That's probably all he had to put on there, or he had built it before the nerf and he's kind of stuck with it. Okay, I think we're just going to go hog wild here. Let's just go right in here. Let's do a full... Oh my gosh, an Inky! You're out of here, living legend. This is, I was going to say we're going to do a little spawn point raid, but this is a full-blown spawn point raid. We got Fenrir's, we got Ocho's out here. We got lots of different builds out here. This is, this, this is a serious match. There's some serious firepower out here. Okay, here's another living legend. Wow, that, that is... <laughs> this is getting close to, I think, my personal best with the Dagon. I get one. Oh, no, 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 no. I'm not going to tangle with that. I need to get down. Uh, I'm not going to be able to go nose to nose with a rook in this. Now, I might try it with the Ocho. Oh, someone's got, someone's got a, a Newton behind me. I'll take the assist. That works. So we can continue the spawn point rate. Oh, there we go. I can't quite tell if that's a... I think, I think that was a Typhon right there. No, I stand corrected. That was like an Erebus or something. Uh, let's go ahead and get the Typhon that spawned right behind him. That was Z as well. Okay, so we got uh, we got this all cleaned out right here. Okay, let's go ahead and move back. Let's uh, we need to cap some beacons. If I mean we've got the beacon advantage, we've got the power bar heading in the right direction. Got just a beasty run right now. Um, I'm gonna have to drop the Titan here in a little bit. Just uh, I may have to just bail out of this bot so I can uh, get the Titan out there for the honor points. But. Let's go ahead and grab this. We're, oh, come on, come on, come on. We're losing a beacon. Looks like we have, we've already lost one player. So it is, come on. 
or excuse me, it was the red player did, and now we just lost one. Now we just lost. Yep, this is a five v five match now. I was looking at the red, thinking, "I hey man, that was just that was just goofy." But <laughs> we are now five v five instead of six v six, and I am still on my first bot. Oh, okay, boom! Finally got hammered out right there. Got Smuda, an MK three Smuda Z over there has some serious firepower. Let's get this guy out here. It's time for a little love from the Ocho. Come on, come on, come on. Die, 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 die. And there we go. There's a nice tight slayer right there. That was with the damper. Let's sit right up on top. Right up on top. There's Z. Let's give him a little love. Yeah, let's, come on, come on, come on. Reload, reload. And we should get him. Die already, you big goofball. There we go. It was worth the damage that was inflicted to me. Okay, we're down to two beacons. It's 4v4. We've lost it. It looks like another player on each side is botted out. This is, oh man, this is turning it. This is turning into just a fun, fun brawler. Leg breaker. See, there's a there's a beastie bell that still holds up. Devastator and Havocs on that that uh, cryptic fen rear. That is still actually a, a pretty decent build and one that you can build in the workshop. That is one that still holds up the test of time. You put the uh, wolf pilot with that. Definitely, definitely worth your time to build it. If I were to say to build something in the workshop, that would be one that's uh, worth it and will actually last for a while. Okay, we need to get rid of this Titan as well. We got him loaded up, and there we go with the DOT effect. Okay, we got one. Oh, no, 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 you big old... Uh, yep, yeah, we got one right down there. That was an ardent behemoth, I believe, or at least a behemoth. So four weapons on it. But it's gone. It's over. Okay. Oh man, we're, I didn't realize we're down to. Oh man, we're down to two, and it looks like it is down to just me, and maybe yeah, we're down to two. So this is this is not good. We're losing the beacons. We're losing control of them. I think oh, living legend. <laughs> this is we are get, we're getting the kills, boys. We are really destroying this out here, uh, and I am capping beacons. I'm trying to catch them as I can here. Oh, come on, come on, Productions. You need to go down. I think my DOT effect will get him when he comes out of uh, Electric Glide right there. Or I'll just fire on him. There we go, we'll take him. Take him with the damper. Okay, let's get this right here. Yeah, it's just me. It's me versus them. Two of them left. Oh, no, 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 no. Reconnect. Oh, get the Wi-Fi off here. Come on, come on, come on, come on. There you go, Wi-Fi disconnected. It'll kick into 5G. Don't, don't kick me out of the game. Don't kick me out of the game. Okay, back in. Poof da that that was really really close right there. I thought it's like this was such a good match. I really really don't want to lose it on a flipping disconnect. Okay, there we go. We got ourselves that oh there we go. Let's get that Lynx. We got ourselves that Ocho. He's that Ocho, I tell you. Why you ate? <laughs> I don't know why you ate. You were hungry? Uh, I'm guessing. Or is that why you be gub? I think we're just going to do is just get him off the battlefield. There we go. Nice double kill. Oh, we have one of ours come back. There he is down there, Al. Was it uh, Alessa? And there's one of them left, two of them left. It looks like one of them a Titan. Oh, my gosh. This is so, so close. Oh, we're losing it. We're losing it on the beacons. And it's back down. Yep, it's, there's two of us, but we just don't have enough beacons held here. Let's go ahead and get on this guy right here. And you can see I have the Shy Drone on my uh, Ocho right there. And that's just for, I can stack up damage resistance like crazy with that build. All right, let's go ahead and take a look real quick at the scores. We had to have like 19, 21 kills, nine beacon caps. Wow, I think that's my that's my personal best since coming back in September of last year. I mean, seriously, that was an absolute pounder. We lost it, nine beacons and we lost. That is absolutely crazy. Let's go ahead and take a look here. Yeah, yeah, it's like, uh, you can see, yeah. You can see well, how we lost it. It was Beacon Control. Shout out to Deya on the other side and YU8. Uh, 11 and 9, 10 and 5. I mean, seriously, they, they took the match over there. This was an absolute pounder. Shout out to everyone in here. It was just a fun one. All right, guys, if you like what you're seeing and hearing, make sure to give us a thumbs up. Subscribe to the channel. Hit that bell for notifications. That way you know when I'm dropping it. All right, you guys, stay safe and healthy. Watch out for each other. I'll catch you on the battlefield.